Hello and welcome. In this session, we are going to look at how to add downloadable files to our content type. We need a, a special field for to attach downloadable files to our content. So let's do that. Say for example, gathering business requirement. So this is an article. For any reason, if you want to add some attachments, say PDF files, documents, text files, or compressed files, we need to add a field here, a downloadable field to this content type. To do that, go to structure, content type, article, manage field. We need to add a field. So the field type is a file type. There we are, there is a file type available. So let us uh, give a name, downloads, it's a more meaningful name, save and continue. In the field settings, enable field display field and the files dis displayed by default. Let's choose that. Allow the number of values, uh, let's say unlimited because we want to have quite few. You should be able to attach multiples, let's say unlimited. Or maybe we can limit to maybe up to five, maybe say save field. So that is the label and this is the help test for that label, what it is supposed to be. Some explanation about the field. An easy to required field? Not necessarily. So these are the allowed extensions. We have a, a text file, a PDF, um, let's say DOCX, the word file, and uh, say zip file. Another thing to notice that I'm not adding in you know, a .zip, .pdf, .txt like that. Drupal says, says we don't need that, so it's better to put that information in here. We can add a help text here to indicate that uh, no need to include the leading dot. And the directory also indicate where, where you want the, the files to go. In our case, just let's say downloads and uh, articles. So all the downloads belong to the articles goes in one place, something like that. Of course, based on your organizational in information structure, you create the directory where you want it. You also better to mention a maximum upload size so that people don't upload too big files. And let's say for our purpose, say five megabits should be enough. After putting the, the file size, we can also add a, a description field. Let's do that. The description field allows users to enter a description about what is the file about save settings so we created a, a field a download field a file type is file to article content type now the next thing to do is uh, test this out so let us edit uh, an article so let's go back um, the site oh sorry these are not article these are uh, the course content type so let's edit uh, an article content type say content type sort this is an article content type. So what is new in Drupal? So let's edit that. Click on that. So this is an article. There is an image and text. So if we are going to edit, there should be a new field coming up. Let's see. Edit. The tags, image, photo, credit, and add a new field. Photo creditor. Maybe I should add my name there. And download. So this is the help text. Actually, help text should go under, so we can adjust that. And it says, do not include leading dots. Okay, so choose the file. Let us choose um, fields to attach. One, two, three, open. There we are. So I'm attaching multiple files. This is the icon indicating what type of file it is. We can write here some description if, if you like. This is a PDF file, and you can write a description. This is a text file, and you can write a description. You can add more. For, for our test purpose, we put a maximum of five files, up to five megabytes each. So this, this one you can show or not show. So we added the three files. Let us save and keep published. So this is the article. If you go down, where is it? It's over here. So you, it's better to make move these files above the comment lines. So it makes more sense. To move this above the comment, we need to adjust the article content type display. 
So in order to do that, structure, content type, article, manage field, manage display, and just move the download just under the body, it makes more sense. Save it and go and have a look. There we are. So the attachment downloads now, attachment is moved up. It is more uh, sensible. If you have uh, only one file, no problem, but if you, have, if you have multiple files, it's a good idea to put on uh, some sort of a format, like uh, on a table or something. It looks much better. So let's do that. Go to structure, content type, article, manage field, manage display. And this is our download field and it is a generic file we put it into table of files that's better and save it let's have a look there we are it now the download field is now on a table all the all the files are displayed and with this size it is much more useful to have downloads to display this way like image files all these attachment files these are listed in the in the content and in files you know what type of file it is we just added these three files it says the name of the file it says what type of file it is and the size and, and where it is used that is very useful information for uh, content management so in this session we learned about how to add downloadable fields to a content type thank you for watching